resentful, I'm angry, I'm bitter, I'm all of that and above, and some more. Jacqueline Mayberry's brother, 57-year-old Johnny McLean, is serving time at Trousdale Turner Correctional Center. Last month, he was stabbed multiple times, including once in the eye, she says. He was recently released from medical care. They had put him in a cell with a gang lord, which was a gang lord, uh, supposedly, that stabbed him. Mayberry spoke with her brother on Thursday. He had told me that he probably wasn't going to be alive today. And a lot of guys had surrounded him by the phone and stuff. But he said, uh, know that I know the Lord and know that uh, I love you and I would never go to PC. I'm a soldier. PC is short for protective custody, she says. But now she's on edge, waiting for him to call her back. The fact that I was, I'm powerless and I can't do anything about it at that moment. I don't want to cry on, on here, but whew, I was praying. She got a message from the prison Friday morning. He called me and told me that he signed himself up in PC. I don't know if he's alive or dead, honestly, but I'm going to accept that he's alive. But I do know he did not sign himself in the PC. There are several families across the mid-state that are concerned about what's going on at Trailsdale Turner Correctional Center. And despite that DOJ investigation, there are still issues being reported. You don't have enough staff. That's dangerous to them and dangerous to the inmate. So if you don't have that, why are you trying to keep it open? It's all about the Benjamins. It's all about the money. Mayberry is turning to her faith as the DOJ conducts their investigation. I don't have confidence in man, period. Honestly, I trust the Lord. I pray that DOJ is going to do uh, the, their job. In Nashville, Aaron Cantrell, News Channel 5.